Here at Enumclaw City Hall, King County Council started rebuilding a government it effectively blew up just a couple of months ago. I do solemnly swear or affirm. I do solemnly swear or affirm. The oath of office delivered tonight to most of the nine new commissioners who are about to see government from inside the trenches. These trenches, the public drainage systems in the South County, called King County Drainage Districts 5, 6, and 13. Each drainage district has three elected commissioners who were all kicked out of office earlier this year for elections irregularities. When was the last time the voters voted for you? We had haven't had anybody run for probably about 30 years. In April, we revealed that Commissioner Alan Thomas was last elected in the 1980s. Because of an antiquated state law that doesn't require routine elections, there have been no ballots cast in any of the county's seven drainage districts since 2000. These men, a fire chief, a city worker, and an Enumclaw businessman, will now run the most troubled district, the 18 miles of unkept ditches in Drainage District 5 that Thomas governed until recently. I think we're all vested in a community. We all have a strong interest in that, and I think that you know our intent is just to try and make sure that, that things are right. That's especially important since our story showed that 413,000 tax dollars ended up in the personal bank account of Thomas and his wife. That money was supposed to pay for the maintenance of the trench system that prevents flooding in and around Enumclaw. It's at the end of the day, we need to see if uh, any, of there's, any of that money can be brought back to the public. Um, not sure what we'll be able to do about it. Records show Thomas, a longtime dairy farmer, spent most of the money on livestock feed and personal expenses. He's now under police and FBI investigation. King County Councilman Reagan Dunn says the county prosecutor expects to charge Thomas any day. I was told this week, this week, and I'll be very disappointed if it doesn't happen this week. Thomas has denied that he misspent any taxpayer money. In Enumclaw, Chris Ingalls, King 5 News.